in our own individual worlds. Let's talk about it. Let's condemn it. What is not good is not good. As a woman, as a mother, as a leader, you must live by example. You must dress decently. Aside of those that stick out their boobs in the name of fashion and their cleavages, you see other women wearing short dresses, short skirts, that they now find it so difficult to walk, so difficult to sit down, half of their body naked, with fat thighs and fat legs. If you're blessed with so much flesh, we don't want to see your skin. We don't want to see your laps. A decent woman will wear something decently. At least that will be knee length. That's what we call it. Many years ago. You can't wear knee length anymore? For goodness sake. What we are teaching our children. It's not good at all. It's not good. Whenever I see anyone, they don't have to be my daughter. Because all daughters and sons, they are our children. I don't hesitate to correct. But before you correct, you look at yourself. Are you decently dressed as a mother? Because it will be so ironical. If you are not dressing well and you want to correct, please let us stop abusing the psyche of our men. And then to you husbands, I wonder why you can't correct your wives. Husbands that allow their wives to dress anyhow are husbands that do not value such women. I can't imagine myself dressing anyhow, dressing in a way that half of my boobs are sticking out. My husband will ask me, I beg your pardon? That's all he needed to say. I beg your pardon? I got the message. And so from now on, please, the husbands have a lot of role to play here. We're talking of moral decadence in the society. Let's start from this narrative. As a responsible man, that you want men and women out there to res respect your wife when you're going out to church, to weddings, to any social function whatsoever, any corporate outing, take it upon yourself to ensure that your wife is properly dressed. If she has a penchant of showing half of her boobs, tell her he's no longer in vogue, he's out of vogue. We shouldn't be abusing the psyche and the mind of our men. Our husbands are responsible men. And responsible men would attract responsible wives. Not women that would just say they want to go steal show. Which one do you want to steal? It's those that are not confident. They, 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 know, they know what they're sold. That would think, okay, let's flounce this. Let's flounce that. Your body is sacred. Your body is the temple of the Lord. And you should preserve it that way. That's your pride. Stop abusing our psyche. And that's the only way we can evolve a better society. That's the only way we can evolve a better nation and a better generation of youths. Our children are watching us. Let us be good examples to our children. Thank you very much. I remain Omotaya Motusho, member Federal Republic. God bless you.